Hello everybody, how's it going? My name is Inkai, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to Slate Aspire. I have great news for you. The game has received another weekly update. This time it's massive. Uh, I don't even know where to start. Well, let's start here. There is a... Uh, uh, well, no, I, you know what? Can I get the patch notes here? Is that is that a thing? Yes. Yes. Okay. Let's actually use this. Yeah, that's, that's quite easy. Uh, run history. You can you can see your past runs, and this includes, uh, you know, all the cars you had in that run, all the relics you had. Uh, you also see brand new icons for bosses on 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 acts. Uh, so like the final acts of or final boss of every act uh, has this cool ass icon now, which is really crisp and really awesome looking. You're gonna you're gonna love it. Uh, it really helps you kind of, I guess, plan what sort of deck you want to continue making on specific floors. Because, say, if you're going up against a Time Eater, you don't want to have a, a heavy combo deck. Maybe if you realize that you're going up against him, then you just kind of change your strategy a little bit. Uh, fast mode, uh, a lot of actions and effects are uh, fast now, which is awesome for especially someone like me who records or someone like me who has close to 100 hours in this game you know uh, there's also twitch integration where you can actually vote for cards relics or skip you know and that's gonna be awesome so get ready guys we're gonna we're gonna stream more of this game thank you for joining me last i mean thank you for your continued support on videos thank you for leaving likes and uh please don't forget to leave a like in this video as well and uh yeah love you uh update animations a bunch of bug fixes. Ascension now has gone up to level 15. So there are not just 10 Ascension levels. 15 now. There's a new card, Expertise. Uh, there's some buffs to uh, Runic Cube. Some enemies like the Torch Head and the Collector. Has like a nerf slash buff. Uh, yeah. Check it out. And we're actually going to switch from the Ironclad to the Silent. Because I have two unlocks remaining for her. And the cool thing is that you can you can do ascension and do your unlocks. So we're gonna do that. How about hello again? Hello to you. I brought you back. I thank you. What the heck sort of map is this, Montfrere? And who you be? I don't. What? What is that enemy? Where do we go from here? Oh my goodness. This map looks bizarre. Uh, many paths are too dangerous to thread. We're gonna go this way? No, let's go this way. We're gonna go to the shop twice. We're not gonna have a lot of money. But... I, I, this floor is extremely bizarre. Uh, safety is more important for the silent. She has quite a lot of cool things happening for her. I don't. I, I haven't played a lot of her on my channel because we've focused so much more on the ironclad, and uh, it's one of the reasons why I, I wanted to play her because I've played many many tens of hours of her, like 40 hours as a silent off camera. And, uh, you guys deserve to see some cool action. She already has a synergy between her own relic, which allows her to draw two extra cards at the start of every combat, and the fact that she has Survivor for one cost, which is already better than Defend, gives her a ton of block, especially upgraded. These two need to get upgraded immediately. Uh, and discards a card, so you thin out the deck very fast. So you have like a discard thin deck daddy synergy happening from the beginning, uh, which is awesome. But you have to be extremely cautious and slow because uh, no damage is acceptable. You're not healing. From anything 
unlike the ironclad, you're not getting any HP back at the end of combat. And, uh... Life is generally... Oh, I should have just gone out. All out attack. What a mistake. What a mistake. See, this is a mistake that you should not be making as this character. This is what I need. Absolutely. But... Poison's great too, but you know, we need... We need, uh... We need something that actually thins the deck out because Survivor is not a real mill de mil real mill card, uh, but it keeps your hand manageable if you end up drawing a lot. This actually helps you get th get to the cards that you need, but we don't have any exciting exciting cards, so I don't know. I'm still gonna take it. Getting some poison damage, even if, it, if you don't have a poison deck, if it's just supplementary damage, you know that I'm a huge fan of it. Definitely remove a card. Absolutely. You know what? Skip the first drop. Expertise. Draw cards until you have six in hand. Quick slash. Deep breath. Actually, I... Don't mind taking deep breath or another neutralize. Neutralize deep breath. Where was it? Was it here? Where was it here? Perfect. Remove defend. Attempted to take footwork. You know what? That has to happen because this is our better defend card, right? Okay, well, let's go here. I don't know where we're gonna go after that, but interesting deck so far, indeed. Why not? I'm loving this. We're untouchable. We're Iron Man. Woman. Um. We can afford doing this, but it's such a dead card if we don't get a discard. It's such a dead card if we don't get a discard. But we have discard opportunities. But do we want to just add that? Yeah. I think we do. But, like, uh, all of these. 
Come on aboard. Welcome. Let's take the path of lots of gold. Oh, this is something beautiful and rare that once every blue moon happens with this island, we get to feel as powerful and as dangerous as the ironclad. You make people vulnerable on first turn, you get all of these cards in your hand. And that's why I just ballsly came to this guy. To an elite. Because I think we can handle them. This, this first turn itself is... Oof. Look at this. Look at this. Now we just race him. And we discard this for damage. Uh, we weaken him. So he deals four. Uh, he's going to do something mean to me. But... Uh, I'm not done doing mean things to him. Haha! -ha. I have strength. Where did that come from? Actually. Or, what? Oh wait, potion. <laughs> I was just talking and just naturally popped that. You know. It's the uh, life of a gangster. <coughs> Excuse me. You're dead. We can handle something like this. Or, or I mean, like, manage it. Bullet time? No. You don't understand. I'm so powerful. I don't need to rest. Rest is for the weak. My only issue with this card is that it's a, it's a random enemy. Random events on a card that is already unplayable unless you can make something specific happen to just deal damage. It's way too much. For it to just be a random enemy too, because you have to work so hard to make it happen that it just probably hits a slime that you didn't want to kill. You know? It's poop. Take the five. We don't have AoE. We kind of have AoE. But we can have better AoE. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm kind of weak and tired now. I said rest is for the weak. I feel weak. You know? You need rest. Get off my case. Definitely that. Definitely this. Definitely. That for free. Dump a strike. Neutralize you for more damage. It's not enough to kill you. Boom. Alright. We didn't do anything to this guy, but that's fine. Oh, uh, he's poisoned. 
do this. We hope that the random enemy is the enemy we want. It's not. And that's what sucks about that card. Uh, we'll play that. Cover all the damage. And the fact that we're going to be vulnerable soon. Nah, never mind. We're not dead. I mean, he's he's not. She's not dead. It, it's, it's not dead. See? What are, what are we doing with this? Just sitting there. High damage card. Nothing to do with it. Yeah, we need we need cycling more to get discards. Um But a bunch of these cards need to get upgraded. Terribly. Neutralize. Like, neutralizers need to get upgraded to become too weak. Um, footwork. Uh, so, speaking of which, play it. Love it. Pull it. Bop it. Twist it. Not get hasty. I'm just afraid of the dazed. Who are you gonna hit? Surprise me. I love the new animation. I love that this guy... And I love that my channel has like pretty much chronicled the development of this game too from like the very early days. Because uh, they, they used to like be almost inanimate and just like go up and down a little bit and forward and back. But like they had no other animation but now they have attack animations and when they get get hit they like bend backwards and stuff like that it's incredible I'm so proud <laughs> I'm so proud of you it was such a great job in this game I love it it's, it's not dying we're gonna be here for a while it seems Death card. I'll work on you. Let's just work on you. This is inevitable damage. We can't kill you, sadly. But it's true. But we can kill you before you deal damage to me again. How many dazes do we have? Too many dazes here, buddy. Too many dazes. Okay, so that's already damage gone. You're dead. Amazing. I should have just not discarded that because it would have evaporated. You know, welcome to my world. Where you have to be perfect for your YouTube videos and you make stupid mistakes like that. People troll you. We're fine. <laughs> Honestly, nothing would have prevented that or the damage that we took. <laughs> that was incredibly bad. You're dead. Goodbye. I just want to be at full HP for once in my life, please. Choke. Oh, that's your icon? I, I was gonna guess. But I... 
didn't expect. You're already gonna deal damage to me and ruin this? I can't believe it. Don't! Ah! This, is, this guy is one of your worst enemies at the silent because he needs to deal so much damage to him and it's really hard. Barely. Ooh, look at the fast mode go. Look at it go! Woo! That card! Yeah, we can't bring you low enough, so it's ridiculous for me to take that much damage, especially when I have footwork. Like, what are we thinking, right? Please leave me alone, though. You're attacking me again? What's wrong with you? This doesn't leave me alone. Stop licking me! It's gross! Oh my god, I'm, we're about to die. Please be the right random enemy. Please be the right random enemy. Good job. Take damage. I don't know why I didn't play Survivor. <laughs> don't judge me, okay? I didn't I was not thinking about frail. Dude, I'm not even scared. This would be incredible if you could make it an eight. Eh? Also a bit choke if you can get an extra energy. But Wraith form is so expensive. If you upgrade it, it doesn't get cheaper, it just goes up to 5 damage. But we do have skills. <laughs> I'm not trying to brag, but you know. <laughs> Alchemize is always good. Let's go Alchemize. It can help us get regen potions if, if we're lucky enough. And that will help this. Because we don't have any other way to... Help sustain full HP. Alchemize, please help me. Schmelp. See, this is not a strong enough poison deck for this matter. You could also counter argue that, yeah, exactly for that reason, take it because if you have a little bit of poison on enemies, you want that transfer, so it, it 
gets better and better. Oh my god, it's snowing like crazy in Chicago. I, 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 I kid you not, it's already three inches of snow and it's a blizzard outside. No exaggeration, it's really three inches of snow. Check the weather. Today is Feb 9, Friday, early morning. I like my gold. We can also, we can also, check this out, transform. Two strikes and a defend. And upgrade them. Oh, oh, wait, 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 fast mode, hold <laughs> on. Yeah. This is perfect with choke. Catalyst, I guess, works with noxious fumes. I, this is like both of both, best of both worlds. We wanted a, a little bit of extra poison. I guess we get catalyst in exhaust form, but it's triple. You know, it's plus triple enemy's poison. That's incredible. And it goes away, so thickness is not really affected much. Uh, plus, we didn't really add cards to the deck. We just, you know, transform. And this one goes away, too. So we have a bunch of cards that just exhaust. The power also is removed. So, ultimately, once we play everything... One, two, three, four... Five... Five cards are just gonna go. So we'll literally have only 14 cards in circulation. And we're gonna try our best to keep taking, take more out. And we're only on, on an act two, so looking forward to it. Also, if we can use Alchemize to keep ourselves at full HP, then I can also do Jiria. Jiria? I don't know. What that is. Automaton! Alright, let me just use the bathroom, I'll be right back. Okay, fortunately, already at full HP. I think this is a good turn for Choke. Maybe even weak potion. No, we have neutralize. Definitely neutralize. Prepared. I want to alchemize first. Yeah, you're a horrible enemy. Horrible enough for me to want to do this. Can't play this. That's pretty awful. Because I have extra energy too. That's terrible. You know, a discard potion would be nice too. A rare discard potion, as rare as the ancient potion. Very specific situational. And if you know, you just obtain it. And then if you don't want it, you just get rid of it. You replace it with something better, but. Could be pretty interesting and useful. It could help you discard curses out of your hand. Uh, it could be useful for. So, I mean, so many different things. Like that attack card can enable stuff. I think that would be a great idea. Just do it! I think there's a case to be made for Sucker Punch Plus. 
but I'm, I'm happily married to two neutralizers. So I don't know. She can't even block him. Wow, this is cruel. Considering that we have neutralizers, I'm kind of ten tempted to take finisher, although I've hated finisher in the past. And trash talked it. This is amazing too. We gotta go with backflip. There's one thing we have a lot of, it's uh, skills. You're breaking my heart. I can't remove a card and get one of these? I mean, I understand if you're not gonna let me take both of these, but like, really? Don't go breaking my heart. This is five to all enemies. Even if we can make it happen like once. Don't go breaking my heart. Um. I hate you. I'm trying to keep a decent amount of HP here, alright? And you just keep making my life more difficult get out of here I got my own issues your addiction is not my problem See the 10 damage, it needed to be dealt to this guy, but it didn't happen, and now we're looking, I mean, we're still okay, but it didn't have to be the, this way, it didn't have to be like this. Okay, this guy's gonna go. Because he's going to go crazy on us. He's going to go crazy, crazy on us. But Alchemize is also very good to hear. I'll do that first. Alright, perfect. Do that. There are many, many things that we can do. 
many things. Many, many things, but alchemize. Yeah, perfect. Ish. Yeah, we don't need to do it. Let's just uh, hit you. Nah. Hit you. Nah. Hit you. Yeah. It's fine. Let's go. It's, it's, decisions are tough with, with the silent, especially when you're low HP. And uh, you need to have full HP. Uh, uh, oh, what a dilemma. Slowly but surely, we make zero progress. Every once in a while, we get to hit this guy with a freaking neutralize. But now, things are different. Hiya. 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 Uh, I was hoping for more neutralizes. Where art thou? You're you're there, but it's not even like the correct order. But it doesn't matter. Um, I'm down. Why do you think we got we got alchemize for this purpose? For this very reason. This is a lot of damage. Plus it's a skill for more extra damage, and then do this. Perfect. 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 Get out of here, you the little. Oops. Your boss is dead. Exactly. Forcing poison on me. I ain't Biden. Forcing a lot of things on me. Most half of my relics are useless, kinda. Yeah, but gold on the on the loser. Come on. Yeah, baby. We're rich. We're rich. Let's go to Vegas. Um sad We have alchemize. We should just look forward to regen potions. Just pretend live in ignorance bliss that one day we will get a regen potion and life will be beautiful. Lantern gives us one extra energy at the start of combat, but that's it. And this guy sucks. Hello. Shiv is not guaranteed to be free. Um, I think let's do that. Let's do this. Let's do that. I want the attack cards, man. Give me the attack cards. I want to play a skill just for the damage. The shiv is going to be pointless. It's not going to cause zero. Like, the shiv is most likely just going to be like... Three! <laughs> Fifteen. Alright, alright.
Ah, uh, did I mention that I hate this guy? You know, you should get like a bonus against him if you have his skull. He should he should take extra damage. <laughs> Can't say no to that. Get out of here, Schmacko. Schmacko. Okay, you, you you think that the best way to go about this is to kill this guy first? No, I don't think so. This guy needs to go. She has a ton of HP, she deals a ton of damage, and she makes your life a ton of difficult. Hit the right target, please. Wrong. You need to die. I'm sorry, but you have to go. It's already too much damage. My god. I don't know if I should say that we're lucky or that we're unlucky but we lived might as well actually take another one of these because life is pain and I love it I love it we're gonna die it's over GG oh my god so much damage can we block is the is question here I think we can Good enough for now. I did not consider just killing them. <laughs> I didn't think I'm this powerful. <laughs> did you just activate? Did you just activate for me, baby? Oh, 
Oh, it's just a. She died. Yo, I need you to be amazing. Hold on. Batman. No! Since you guys are used to like three and a half hour long, oh my god, the snow is insane. Uh, it's four and a half. Uh, yeah, we're gonna be buried forever. Uh, sometimes seven hour long episodes of Slate Aspire on my channel. Uh, we're gonna do another run. We're gonna try to get. I don't know. Bar. We'll see. We'll see. It's fast mode. Okay? Fast mode enabled. Sure. It's actually pretty good. Da 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 I like this path right here. With it, all the question marks in the world. Alright, everything we said about this character still applies. Play safe. Use a condom. That's a message that should be uh, spread out to people of all ages. No matter where you are. That's why I'm uh, going to use my platform as well to advocate. Use of a condom. At all times. Extremely important. Do not forget. Safe sex. It's more important than leaving a like on my radio. I was absolutely true. You know what? I should have just played another block for the one freaking damage. You poop, dude. You poop. Get out of here. Please die. Forget choke. Choke needs a lot of energy. Just don't randomly take choke. It's not gonna pay off. I'll I'll find a freaking relic. It's kunai. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. This is incredible. Wait, can I kill anything? I don't think so. Can I? No, 10. Nah, I just. Just, just fine, just pass. Keep the agonies. So, Aspire to have an extremely tiny deck. Building on agonies, like anger, but agony. Is there exhaust energy with this? With, with the silence, silent. Uh, perhaps. Silent. We can do dagger throw. It's actually pretty good for agony. Endless agony, and then take out a strike. Yes. Yank it out. Yank that strike out. Give it a go. I'm so greedy this turn. I'm confident. I feel strong. <clears throat> oh, this guy's nothing. Oh boy, you're dead. Ah, you're so dead. Like a villain. What you doing? I wanna crush you. 
How are you feeling? Okay, let's not get too excited. He's not the boss. Um, so we still need to take minimal damage and maximize the damage on him because he's gonna siphon us like a abandoned cars gas tank on a side road siphon all the gas out. Uh, defend against this nonsense. Keep the endless agonies. We're gonna chain a lot of them. I totally should have played everything in the in the other order, but uh, it's the first time that I'm experiencing this awesomeness. So, as you can see, I'm picking up all the mistakes on the fly, and uh, things will very soon be different, my friend. Shut the hell up. That's what I'm trying to say. Again, made the same mistake, but, you know, fool me three times, shame on the whole internet. Might as well. It's the power goes away, you know, it's not gonna add to the thickness really. And uh, maybe if, oh, if if it's upgraded it'll be cheaper too. Yeah, perfect, perfect. And then Endless Agony synergizes with it. And uh, life is beautiful. I'm actually going to take the three. To be honest, I don't have to. I love this fast mode. It actually makes your combos look even more glorious as you just swing at them like that. Slice for kunai. Or acrobatics for endless agony. And also, if we get curses and status cards, it's it allows us to discard things, you know? Oh... Another one? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. One copy in a 15 card deck is perfectly fine. Remember, people make 60 card magic decks with four copies of a card in it and they still show up. So keep that. That's actually a good way to think about it. If you've played like Yu Gi Oh! or Pokemon card games or like Magic the Gathering. Hopefully, and not the former two. Uh, uh, yeah. You, you, you know what I'm talking about. We have to go to the shop. Dude. It doesn't exhaust. It costs zero. It gives vulnerable. Everything is good here. Okay, no. Let's not do that because we have anchor. Huh. Of 
course we get these guys. Of course. I have to crush you. Oh, which is totally doable. Then, uh, I guess the middle guy should be crushed. Uh, I'm, I'm doing this based on the order of them basically attacking me. Nine. Discard. Acrobatics, actually. Just gonna poison and kill you. Your damage is inevitable, but I can weaken you. Zero damage. Um, then I'm gonna have to kill you, so we're not taking damage from you. Then you'll, you're the last one. I'm not going to discard a daze, because I want it to just evaporate. And we're good. We're good to go. We did that almost flawlessly. Do... <sighs> It's a wasted relic right now, at least. And I think it will forever be. Sadly. Flying Knee is a great card, but I'm not going to take anything here. We're just going to skip. We're going to go to the second shop and the question mark and sleep. Enjoy life. dead and I guess someone gonna have to kill you it's looking good it's looking good I don't want to sound overconfident but it's looking uh, okay Doing such a poor job. <laughs> Not that it's risking anything, but it's just hilarious. Uh, discarding, there's no benefit to discarding this many cards and, and losing a card like this, but prepared is just straight up good. And it, again, allows us to maybe pick up curses, you know?
I don't care about getting a specific offer, like full HP and things like that. I just want to get rid of a card that I don't want. Buddy, you're dead. Like, super extra extremely dead. We almost didn't do anything at all, but still dealt 19 damage to him, and I think this is an alright turn to kinda bring him closer to 70. Can I even? Nah, it's so bad. This is so bad. We only have one Agony. I kind of feel like maybe we should take this 26. We're not going to take it, actually, because the poison is going to split him. So let's just split. Let him 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 split. I hate a debuff where you get one less card. Let him split. Let him split. Let him split. Having to bring you guys down to 33, 34. I can take the 11. Because in the future it's going to be even less because we have more decks. Don't play the, end the Endless Agony yet. Schmellus Schmagony. Discard them, in fact, so we can perhaps draw them faster now um, I don't think the potion is necessary we've done a good job clap clap I don't have as many agonies as I want. As I need. We're gonna take some heavy, heavy damage here. Oh my lord. It's, just, what, it's, it's funny. Most of the time when enemies attack, they start from front to the back. But sometimes they go from back to front. What gives? It's important to know because maybe a size base, like smaller enemies attack faster and whichever side has the smallest enemies goes from that way first. Because, you know, with, with, with relics like Tori, you want to 
sometimes play enough block to block the first guy's damage and enough for this from the second guy's damage to bring it down to five or less to take only one you know it's important to know who's attacking first I'm getting really greedy with these endless agonies, but I want them to be endless. I want them to be literal agonies. Oh my god. I like this. <laughs> This is a lot of agonies. Is it enough to uh, kill? Three each. That's it. You need oh, seven of them. I thought I was gonna be zany and fun and be like, you know what, we're gonna get so many endless agonies and I got endless wounds, dude! <laughs> well, leave a like on the video if you liked it. Join me next time for more! Yay! Bye-bye.